Referee JBK calls for a start to this over rope battle royal in the lightweight division. That is the under, under 150 pound mark. And we have a, as you can see, a hell of a ring, an assembly of talent in front of you. Shayna Baszler, Heather Monroe, Kagetsu, Hikaru Shida, Starlight Kid, Chris Stantlander, and of course, Marco Stunt and Naomi. Eight competitors in the lightweight division, all looking to make their name. It's a highly competitive division. We just saw Mayu Iwatani, who's still undefeated in singles action, go 3-0 just last week. And you've got to believe that the winner of this match will certainly have something to hang their hat on in terms of outlasting seven other competitors in this harsh environment. Hard to really call it here in the early going. Lots of action going now. Kagetsu fights off the double teams. It's had Stratlander in the ropes. Starlight Kid fighting away out of the corner on the right side of your screen as she drags away Hikaru Shida. And she and Shida are exchanging now. Shida, a few kicks to the midsection, takes Starlight off the canvas. And a gut buster on Chris Atlander from Hikaru Shida. Marco Stunt running the ropes, nobody home. Puts on the brakes and he's gonna try and go to work here on Shayna Baszler, who meets his strike and answers in kind. Headlock by Shayna on Hikaru Shida. Double team over on the right side of your screen between Heather Monroe and Marco Stun as they connect with a double knee to the face of the great alien. This is over rope eliminations. Both feet hit the floor. You're headed to the back of Big Garden Arena, otherwise known as Madison Square Garden, and the birthplace of actually real wrestling. Hard to believe it was more than eight months ago, back in uh, August of 2019. We started with two matches. Will Ospreay, it was uh, the Usos versus the Young Bucks and uh, Omega versus Moxley, I believe. As a first elimination by Marco Stunt, he tosses Hikaru Shida to the outside. Blinked and you would have missed it. A lot of action here in the corner. As Shayna Baszler transitions into a jumping armbar, Kagetsu hits a Death Valley driver on Starlight Kid. And now has some forearms for Naomi. Cover by Heather Monroe, it seems. Pinfalls also allowed in the matchup as means of elimination. Bad bitchy Noku driver by Heather Monroe though on Starlight Kid, broken up by her compatriot from stardom, Kagetsu. Finishing maneuver of the Killer Bay that Ichinoku driver, and had it not been for Kagetsu, you could have sure bet Starlight Kid would have been out of there. Roll up pin by Kagetsu of Naomi. Two and kick out. Stratlander's in a backslide, but referee JBK was otherwise occupied. Marco Stunt lands elbows on the jawline of Naomi hits a drop kick on Baszler. Sliding drop kick by Starlight Kid. And a double team fought off by Naomi. And Shayna Baszler there to pick up the pieces as a double knees to the face connect to the greatest alien. Marco Stunt with a high angle roll up here. Two and point nine kick out by Chris Stratland. Naomi in the corner. Marco in the opposite side. And could it be a choke slam by Kagetsu? Yes, she gets Shayna Baszler off the canvas. She could be out of here. But a .9 kick out by Baszler. Kagetsu fights off the double team and goes right back to work, sending Baszler into the corner, picks up Marco. Marco, code breaker to the face. Heather Monroe has him. Blade kick to the side of the head. 
but Starlight Kid with a bridge and suplex kicked out with Naomi at 2.9. Face lock, reverse into an arm bar, bar, and it looks like a submission. Looks like Naomi. That was a rope break. Pagetsu at the cover of Marco, broken up by Heather Monroe, who's firing up here. The Killer Bay needs a drop toe hold, needs to regroup, send it to the corner. It is absolute chaos in this corner of the ring. Covered by Kagetsu. Kicked out by Starlight. And a Canadian destroyer in it with pinned by Starlight and Kagetsu doesn't want anyone to win by pinfall, it's not her. And there's the mist, the green mist by Kagetsu. Ironman's carry toss puts Marco on the canvas. And Marco stunts out on his feet and Kagetsu missed with her kick. Wanted to break up Chris Lander's pinning predicament, but it was a kick out anyway. And a falling side slam by the greatest alien. And she eats a hard elbow by Marco Stunt. Kick to the midsection and a bicycle kick on the back of his neck there. And a falling side slam again hits for Stratlander. Puts Starlight down. Kogetsu is just waiting on Stratlander now. Big choke slam on the greatest alien. Could this be it? It's a three count. Chris Stratlander has been eliminated, as has Naomi. Check that. Long pinfall. Naomi pinned on the other side of the screen. So Stratlander gets away with them there. Marco almost got eliminated. He's going to get suplexed back into the ring. Big fall by Kagetsu, kick out. All kinds of commute, confusing eliminations here. 450 by Kagetsu into the pin is broken up by Starlight. She owes her one. Missed with a double stomp. Starlight hits a backdrop. Arm bar submission on Heather Monroe by the Queen of Spades. Baszler now has it cinched in deep. But the Killer Bay able to escape. Snap suplex lands on Starlight Kid. Kick to the midsection of Baszler. Kick to the side of the head. Adam Monroe here. Sets up for a 3D. Momentarily teased with Kagetsu to put down the Queen of Spades. And could she be looking to eliminate her here? No, the arm bar with an elbow snap. Baszler. Transitions into a rear naked choke, but a pin by Stratlander on Starlight is a kick out at point nine. High angle backdrop by Kagetsu. And a bear hug takedown by Baszler. Nothing fancy about that. A couple elbows and a critical bad Bushinoku driver into the pin. I don't think it matters at this point. Let's see if Baszler is able to continue. It appears Shayna Baszler is breathing, but not moving otherwise. I believe that bad Bichinoku driver put her down as a body slam connects. Starlight Kid going to work on the Killer Bay. Going to work on everybody. Jumping kick by Kagetsu. Hits a Death Valley driver on the greatest alien, Chris Stratlander. She could be in trouble here. Russian leg sweep by the Killer Bay. Kagetsu up top hits the 450. That could be it for the greatest alien. She got her. Stratlander is out of there. And now we are down to Kagetsu, Starlight Kid, and the Killer Bay in a battle royal. Who will advance here? Pinned by the Killer Bay on the Bichinoku driver, and she almost eliminates Kagetsu, a 2.9 kick out. Doesn't get any closer than that. Oh, and an elimination 
Fika gets you off of the Samoan drop, sends her to the outside. And a backdrop by Starlight Kid. And we are down to our two competitors out of stardom. World of Wrestling, Kagetsu and Starlight Kid. Escape the fireman's carry into the ropes. Spear tackle by Kagetsu takes Starlight Kid off her feet and she's waiting. Stalking, missile drop kick right to the side of the head. And Starlight Kid motionless. Sliding drop kick. Kagetsu so methodical here. Hard kick to the spine. Hits her with the green mist. Elbow snap to the back of Starlight Kid, and she's not had any offense, any answer for Kagetsu's in the past few minutes. But what she got here an elbow. No! Michinoku driver is a kick out on a rope break. Hard elbow gets a flash knockdown for Starlight Kid. Tacks on a DDT. And now gonna trade with Kagetsu. Who's got the better elbow? 22 minutes into the matchup. Drop kick and then a high temple roundhouse by Kagetsu. Starlight Kid gets behind her into the backdrop. Hitting the ropes here. Head scissors, backing around again, and Starlight Kid fires up Madison Square Garden. They're cheering for her. Front chancery into the body slam. She's headed up top. Frog splash connects for Starlight Kid. Could this be it? No, it's a kick out at two by Kagetsu, who's proven incredibly gutsy throughout the matchup. Has had some real close calls, keeps. Hanging in. And there's a twisting frog splash. Could that be it? It is. Here is your winner, Starlight Kid.